Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I make it specially Hungarian goulash. It's calling from the beef Hungarian goulash. Instead of the beef, I cooked the lamb Hungarian goulash today. Lamb and the, all the recipes is the same, but uh, just a different of the meat. And I can, it's not a natural, real taste, but we like to the lamb and then instead of the beef. And that's why we have to cook today is a uh, lamb. This is very beautiful. This is a uh, beautiful country coming from the these dishes from Hungary. It's lovely dishes and very delicious. And the thousand chef, thousand thousand Michelin star chef, they cooking already all the famous dishes, very famous dishes. And uh, uh, nine hundred century. This coming to this uh, dish and especially any function, any. Uh, and Michelin star restaurant, any five star hotel, you can use the you know, same same dishes. Hungry and gulas, hungry and gulas is very very famous dishes. That's why I would like to test, give it recipe and test for you. And I can test myself also. That's why I do the try to make it you know, hungry and gulas. Keep please follow the my channel and keep continue to watching. I start to now. Uh, how to cooking their hungry in glass. I go to hungry in glass, beef, uh, beef hungry in glass. Instead of the beef, I make the lamb hungry in glass, served with the steamed vegetables. So please uh, follow me. I start to now cooking. Let's just throw on the fire. fan on now, getting getting the hot fan. At the same time, I just make it to steam the water here. And uh, waiting for the fan hot, I'm just drop the oil. We have a few drops. One tablespoon and same getting hot and uh, have to make a color this one and same going to be onion brown it waiting for this uh, heat the pan yeah it's my oil is being getting hot now I'm going to a little bit browny for the meat. This is the Uzban Uzban lamb. Get the most juicy. I don't have any stock. I don't use any stock. I think the stock in myself here. And the same time, I'm introducing the, what they're going to be with you. Sour cream to a tablespoon. Flour, plain flour, salt, and diced tomato, fresh. Tomato puree, garlic cloves, two garlic cloves, and uh, one large onion, black pepper. Uh, Mix bell and bell pepper one just for the half and 500 gram of the beef and uh, one salt of the red wine and uh, parsnip for the uh, vegetables one whole parsnip potato two large and uh, uh, some carrots so I'm going to steam the carrot and potato there and at the same time I do the stew here. Uh, in the color, I just waiting for color here. My meat is going to get color now. See, we, we just going to transfer here. Just a uh, low heat, put in low heat, and uh, transfer here. Just uh, do the whatever. I'm going to be add some onion. Onion and uh, garlic, two cloves garlic. This is coming to uh, cook the stew cook, you know, stew and uh, uh, stew. But you need to take the uh, as much long time, nearly uh, 90 minutes, more than 90 minutes, you will get to very tender. Uh, mix it together. I'm going to add some pepper. And uh, some tomato, this is tomato, fresh tomato. Gently, just gently make it a saute. 
see fine and it's going to be add some uh, smoke paprika powder one one and a half teaspoon and salt one and just for the uh, pinch of a little bit and pepper black pepper and mixing up properly nicely and we're going to be add uh, flour here just for the roux one two two uh, teaspoon and just for the roux so down see the color and we're going to add um, some tomato puree two teaspoon And uh, this is tomato, chopped tomato. Just uh, stirring everything properly. And uh, what do you add? I mean, here. Yeah. The last. I'm going to add some uh, wine. It's, if you're not uh, alcohol free, you, de you didn't put the wine. After you, you don't like it. You, it's not any rule. Put the wine. But I would like to put the wine because I don't have any uh, stock, uh, beef stock using, uh, using for that. So I need to color and for taste and texture, I add the wine. One sort of the wine here. That one. If you are gluten free, you don't put the flour, you can add anything like a corn flour or make the extra onion, large extra, uh, large onion and get to more thick. Same time, I'll add some oil, uh, oil here and uh, just water, a few water and uh, you know, and slow heat. 90 minutes over the 90 minutes you take, you take the uh, between 90 minutes one to two time if you take the temperature it's right uh, tender you can uh, few minutes more if you're ready you can take the anymore but 90 minutes should be cooked already then so a vegetable are going to be uh, put in the later one because of it's uh, till the 90 minutes is a long time i'm going to start on up slow down to there so same time I put the potato here and the underneath the potato. Potato cooked underneath here. And uh, carrot and parsley in the top. Carrot and parsley in the top. Just low heat, go down. Waiting for the 90 minute to the ready for my goulash. My goulash is ready now. Have a look. It's very nice and looks delicious. My vegetables are ready here. Potato and vegetable. I'm going to a little bit salty with butter. And I'm going to add some sour cream here. One and two spoon, a uh, tablespoon. And some use of fresh parsley, fresh parsley, you go, see, looks delicious, nice, uh, the last is ready now, I'm going to serve it now in a few minutes, yeah, vegetables, I'm going to start to put it, butter, Salt, pinching salt, pepper, some chopped parsley, and potato, carrot, and parsley. I'm 
want to put the plate in here, yeah. goulash, it's ready. Looks the color, very delicious. Vegetables, potato, and potato here. Carrot, carrot, and parsley. Need to add some parsley here. Looks very delicious. I know you just sweat the smoked paprika here. Parsley. Parsley. So my dish is ready now. This is hung green glass served with steamed vegetables. If you like the my dishes, please don't forget to subscribe to my video and keep continue to watching to my video until the next video. And if you any have a questions, please let us let me know. And uh, any miss any uh, you want um, any dishes you want, uh, just write the comment box. I, I can try to make it a new um, different type of the any uh, dishes. Thank you very much. Keep watching to my video. See you soon for the next video. Let's go blog.